CBS 17 is your local election headquarters. Good evening and thanks so much for joining us tonight. I'm Maggie Newland. And I'm Greg Funderburg. North Carolina Democrats hosting their unity dinner tonight at a time when fellow party members across the country are divided over whether President Joe Biden should drop out of the race for the White House. CBS 17 Sonica Bargo joins us live. Sonica, a lot of big names at this event. The governor, the attorney general and former House Speaker Nancy Pelosi. Of course, she's been in the headlines a lot lately. Did they address the big question? Maggie, Greg, no, they didn't. Like you mentioned, the big question is the future of the presidential race, but we didn't get a chance to ask former Speaker Pelosi about this or Governor Roy Cooper. His name has been put forward as a possible vice presidential bid if Kamala Harris should lead the ticket, but both of them did not speak to the press tonight or address any of these issues in their remarks. Former House Speaker Nancy Pelosi declining to answer questions about her conversations with President Biden and the pressure he's faced from prominent Democrats to drop out of the presidential race. Pelosi was in Raleigh for the North Carolina Democrats' unity dinner, along with Governor Roy Cooper and Attorney General Josh Stein. In their remarks, all three maintained unity is the only way to win in November. Because there is more that unites us than divides us as Americans. And emphasized the threat they say a Trump presidency and Republican an agenda opposed to freedom and democracy. They don't believe in science. They don't believe in governance. They don't believe in justice. They believe in this goofy plan, a manifesto for undermining our democracy. So Donald Trump's America is where the president is a convicted felon, a chronic liar, and the king of chaos. Is that who we want to be? No mention of the concerns some in the party have voiced about President Biden's viability as a candidate. Instead, Democrats project confidence in a November victory. Are you ready for a great Democratic victory? I thought... Now, Pelosi wasn't the only one who didn't answer questions tonight. Congresswoman Deborah Ross from Raleigh also declined an interview with us. Instead, Democrats tonight only talked about what voters and volunteers need to do to win in November. Live in Raleigh, Sonica Bargo, CBS 17 News.